New at 6, South Padre Island city leaders are asking voters to approve a 2% venue tax this election. Supporters say this will help beautify the island. CBS 4's Tiffany Huertas is here to, in the studio with all those details. Tiffany. Marcy Eddy, the proposed tax is expected to produce millions of dollars to help pay to improve infrastructure and many projects they say will not only bring better quality of life to residents, but enhance the experience for visitors. South Padre Island residents voting this elections have an item on the ballot which, if passed, could affect them for many years to come. This is one way in which South Padre Island voters have a say in which to spend the hotel occupancy tax. According to South Padre Island Mayor Barry Patel, the increase to the hotel occupancy tax would be 2% and for the most part would be paid by visitors who spend the night on the island. If somebody's renting a room for $100, They'll be paying $2 more. Some visitors and locals are in favor of the possible change. $2 more in tax wouldn't affect me too much when visiting the island. Stephen Mondini enjoys going to the beach and says if this is going to help the locals, he's for it. It wouldn't deter me, but I think it would help the community a lot, especially maybe traffic. Tiene mucho turismo y está lleno de... O sea, hay veces que no hay lugar donde pararse los carros. Among the largest projects, the city hopes to generate enough money to build a new parking garage and to improve medians. The proposed tax will generate about $1.7 to $2 million per year. So in about 20 years, at a conservative estimate, it'll be about $50 million that will be invested into South Padre Island. It helps us build infrastructure that otherwise we won't have. Another project they hope to build would be to invest in outdoor activities like paddleboarding and kayaking. In the studio, Tiffany Huerta, CBS4News and ValleyCentral.com.